so look y'all you already know your boy peeks back in the building and you already know today today's a little bit different today we about to go all the way out be more because apparently from what i hear my man gordon ramsey got a got a restaurant out there you feel me and gordon ramsey i know y'all y'all know who gordon ramsey is he's the dude that goes here he goes there he criticizes people's food and he'd be like, yo, dude, you know, your food's not good, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, on that type of stuff, bro. Like, and I get it. You feel me? You Gordon. You got clout. But I'm Peaks, and I do too, and I'm a food critic too. You feel me? Like, I ain't, I ain't the type of critic you is, Gordon. You feel me? I'm Peaks, the black critic. The critic that don't give up about nothing. I keeps it real. I don't sugarcoat nothing. You feel me? I ain't, I ain't pressed for clout or none of that stuff. I'm going to keep it real on here always. You feel me? Good, ma. What's up? You know what I'm saying? Guess where I'm headed? Where you going? I'm about to go try Gordon Ramsay's restaurant now. It's not? I'm going to try Gordon's restaurant and see, you know what I'm saying? See what it says. What you think it's going to be like? I don't know. You think Gordon a good cook? I don't know. I just be seeing this stuff. I don't know. He might be all right. Those of you that hate on Kia, bro, my, my whip's sweet, bro. Y'all be tripping. You know what I'm saying? I got her whipping my whip. But look at this interior. You feel me? Oh, please. My car's sweet. You like, baby, who car you like better? Mine or yours? Yours, obviously. Mine's yeah, my joint's sweet. My joint go fast. This is a race car right here. You feel me? So, look, y'all. It say we at the Gordon Ramsay restaurant. You feel me? Like, it don't, it just look like a building, bro. Like, I don't know what this is. Never been there. Looks pretty fancy. Look, look at that. Y'all see it. That's, that's where Chef Ramsay, you know what I'm saying, does his business at. All right, y'all, look. So Gordon, Gordon know what he doing. Apparently his restaurant's at a casino. This is a casino. See, he, he's smart. He's probably, he thinks the average man can't afford his meals. So if, you know what I'm saying, my man make that coins in the casino, he gonna eat, you know what I'm saying, a little bit of Gordon Ramsay. Little Gordon Ramsay cuisine. But look, I'm here. I'm gonna check out this food right now. We in Baltimore, y'all. I'm going let me give y'all a little, a little view of what B more look like. Let me give y'all some vibes. Cause you know what I'm saying? Y'all, y'all not, y'all not from this area. Y'all from all over the world. So let me give y'all a little city view. Hey, y'all see it. Y'all see it. Y'all know the vibes. You know what I'm saying? Raven Stadium and all that. But yeah, let me go in here and try this food real quick. Try this food for y'all. Hey, I'm gonna rate your shit one day too, bro. I'm gonna rate your shit one day too. You know what I'm saying? Look, 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 look. So look, y'all, we gonna try my boy Gordon Joe. So look, y'all, y'all already know the vibes, you know what I'm saying? But I'll go ahead and try this right here, right now. So look, y'all, I'm at the Gordon Ramsay spot right now, you know what I'm saying? You see my boy Ramsay right there, and I'm gonna let him know Good, you feel me? If it ain't good, I'm gonna let them know right here, right now. Y'all already know how I get down with it. So look, y'all, we gonna start out with a crab cake. You know what I'm saying? Pretty small, but yeah. So look, y'all, she's telling me to stop being ghetto because look, I'm trying to pick up the crab cake with my hand, but she's saying that we in a fancy restaurant. I can't be acting ghetto like that. She's telling me I gotta use a fork. Am I, am I being ghetto? That no wonder it's breaking apart. You know what I'm saying? When I'm trying to pick it up, we in a fancy establishment. Ain't going a lot of you, Gordon. It's, it's packed with flavor, you know what I'm saying? It's a pretty, it's a pretty hefty portion. I know I ain't supposed to use my hands, bro. But look, I ain't going front for nobody. You coming? I ain't going front. So if y'all look at this, y'all can see this is straight crab meat, you know what I'm saying? Gordon ain't trying to jip y'all. He ain't throwing no fillers in that. You feel me? That's that's real Maryland crab right there. So here go the steak, y'all. You know what I'm saying? I got it well done. We got some lump crab on top of that, Joe. Some asparagus. And over here, I got a loaded baked potato. Y'all see it. Y'all see it. Y'all see how tender, you know what I'm saying, this steak is? See, a lot of y'all, you know what I'm saying, y'all be talking about like well done steaks and saying that they, you know what I'm saying, they tough. You see, you see how easy it was for me to cut that? Like you close to my face, baby. I don't hit. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. 
You see it. I remember y'all told me when I told y'all that the roof crisp was trash that I ain't know nothing. This tastes 20 times better than, you know what I'm saying, than the roof crisp one. You feel me? It's got way more flavor. It's got a little hickory taste to the top. It's juicy as hell, even though it's well done. Y'all say that well done steaks, like I said, ain't juicy. Good junk. Juicy. You know what I'm saying? My boy, my boy Gordon, he threw asparagus on that. Asparagus hit. So look, Gordon, they, I give you your props, bro. Look, this is probably one of the best steaks I ever had. Ain't going out of y'all. It's on juicy. It's on season. And it's gonna get a 10 out of 10 for a steak, bro. I'm not gonna hold you. Gordon, don't be capping. So look, y'all, I'm gonna be honest with y'all. That was, you know what I'm saying, a humbling experience. I'm glad, you know what I'm saying, I went out and I tried this, bro, because now, what I said about Roof Chris, and you know what I'm saying, I ended up removing that post because some of y'all was like, you don't know good food, peaks, Bro, Roof Chris is trash, bro. I ate a steak that, that bro, didn't taste nothing like that, bro. Roof Chris is not worth y'all's money. It's not good at all, period. Point blank period, bro. And I needed this. I feel as though I can criticize whatever I want now, bro. And y'all can't say nothing. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm on a journey right now, bro. I'm going places. Trying things, bro. These taste buds, they getting more and more advanced every day. Yeah. him. I couldn't really cut up like I normally do when I was in there, bro. Because I'm in front of a whole bunch of rich MFs. You feel me? Like, you can't... Look. You, you, you see... Bruh, I'm wearing Jordans, bro. Everybody else is all like, you know what I'm saying, dressing up. So it's like, they already looking at me like, you know what I'm saying, this dude right here, he eating crab cakes with his hand. You know what I'm saying? Wifey told me, she's like, baby, you gotta calm down. Is that what you told me, baby? Yeah, you, 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 you need help. She doesn't like that, bro. Like, so I'm like, yo, you know what I'm saying? Okay, I'll try to tone it down a bit. I had to. You know what I'm saying? It was only right. But look, after I, you know what I'm saying, got what I got, now I know, y'all, my taste buds really do work. Because I called it, bro. That joint tasted way different than that Roof Chris, bro. That Roof Chris was trash. I just ate my Ramsey's or whatever, now I'm in the motherfucking yay. Gas station. Try to grab me some drink, yeah. Your boy thirsty. It's like, nah, <laughs> I think it was some different stuff. But look, y'all, I'm by... I'm by yeah. I'm by yeah. Grab one of these bad beauties. We just left the gas station and then get gas, bruh. We only got 37 miles till empty. We on the highway, bro. 43 miles from the crib, bro. I mean, you know your car. Ah! I think Ramsey put something in that steak, bro. Like, I normally don't act like this, bro. I'm screaming, bro. I'm walking in gas stations acting weird, bro. That steak was good, bro. So look, y'all, we made it to the gas station. Only four miles left on this bad boy, bro. And we made it. Oh, yeah. I'm headed to David Buster's right now because the kids keep crying that they want to go to the David Buster's. I'm tired, bro. That Gordon Ramsay job like sat me on my ass. You know what I'm saying? I'm tired, bro. But yeah, we gonna, we gonna go in here real quick. I'm gonna play a couple games and yeah. I'm about to win somebody special, you know what I'm saying? A real big teddy bear real quick, y'all. I'm about to do this right here, right now for y'all. You hear me? You already know how I rock. Oh yeah, real big teddies. You want a teddy bear, baby? Daddy gonna win you a real big teddy bear, okay? Okay. Oh. 